like to call us 94, it's your boy Kizama Tenra and today I bring you back with another review. So before we start with this review guys, I'd love for you guys just to hit or smash that subscribe button, turn on the post notifications to be alerted when a new video drops and share this video with your friends and family to make this channel grow bigger and bigger. So let's get started with this on my next shot. So today is going to be an interesting review. Today we are doing the Audi A3 and not just any Audi A3, a drop top Audi A3. Look at that. So actually coming here on the front we've got our black grill with the silver outline on it, the LED headlight washers and the LED matrix headlights. And on the lower bottom we've got our functional open split and yeah possibly for improved aerodynamics. So then the side is extremely beautiful in every way possible. The paint job is perfect and this is the glacier white. And these are the 15 inch rooms with the twin spoke design on them. And then of course the noticeably soft top is in pure black. So actually coming here at the back we've got our reflectors and then we've got our four blind spot detectors and then we've got our two exhausts and the LED backlights as well. So moving on to the engine specs on this vehicle. This is an inline 4 2 liter turbo making 140 kilowatts and I'm pretty sure this car is very economical if you drive it quite easily. Actually coming into the cabin we've got our steering wheel, it's a leather steering wheel and then on the steering wheel we've got our buttons of course, the scroll buttons uh, just to play around with the infotainment system and then behind the steering wheel which is the basically my favorite buttons the minus and plus buttons these are actually the paddle sh shifters enabling us to actually manually shift the gears by ourselves so then we've got our center console let's just quickly speak about that so then here at the top we've got our drive select button our traction control button and our indicators button and then below that we've got our climate control system this setup it's kind of new to me i've never seen it but it's still function as well and then below that we've got our two cup holders our gear lever and the buttons and the control knob to play around with our uh, infotainment system we've got our electronic handbrake and then uh, just on the left hand side of that we've got our drop top button to drop down the roof and then we've got our storage compartment system I mean like it's not that bad you can fit quite okay not a lot of things but you can fit some things in there and then if we move on to the dashboard it's alright it's okay before we go to the rear end of the car, okay, or the back seats, I just need to show you these electronic seat adjusters. So if you want to move the seat back, you can easily just pull it back. If you want to move it forward, you just push it forward. And yeah. Lifting it up. Putting it down. Wow, well, Audi's just killing it. Okay, let's actually move on to the rear seats. And if you want to move them forward, just this button. Okay and we done we just fold the seat forward and move on to the back okay so here we are at the rear section of the car uh we've got our leather seats which have a real nice and comfortable feel to them and then we've got just like our mini armrest i'm glad that i already had to think about that and then if i just have to close the seat and speak about the leg room and actually move the seat back whoa it's actually readjusting the seat and in terms of like my legroom uh, there isn't much and uh, headroom there's lots of headroom but this car is just not ideal for long distance trips especially if you're the rear passenger if you just speak about the boot space just open it up okay you can see it for yourself there isn't much boot space i have to say unfortunately but if you really need that extra space you can just drop down the seats on either side we've got two latches on either sides and then we've got our nets just to store maybe like our small items that might not want to like roll around and make a lot of noise here at the back so if you want to drop them down there's our latch drop down and another one Okay, what do I think about this car? It's a really fun car and full of amazing fun guys just to play around with. Okay people, that is the review on the Audi A3. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a big thumbs up in this video and stay tuned to the channel because you know, interesting things are coming. Yep, they are coming. So subscribe, turn on the post notifications to be alerted when a new video drops. Stay tuned to the channel and stay blessed.